the Ariadne project is uh, investigating, uh, designing and also uh, will implement partly a novel communication system uh, tailored for the future communications networks beyond 5G, 6G, exploring also additional uh, frequency range, uh, so-called D-band, above uh, 100 uh, gigahertz. We will also investigate uh, the communication system as a changing environment by using uh, reconfigurable uh, intelligent uh, meta surfaces. Uh, by using this, uh, we will be able also to adapt the environment, the communication environment, according to the communication needs. And of course, uh, uh, to deal with the such complex system, we will need to involve machine learning techniques uh, uh, to manage uh, the network. Of course, behind this vision, uh, there is a significant uh, research work needed in terms of channel modeling for the D-band, in terms of uh, specific uh, characterization of the D-band, and also uh, implementation of particular functions, uh, beamforming, uh, uh, dealing with the blockages, and different other things in this system. So, as I said, uh, this is a very, very actual uh, research topic worldwide and also a very complex topic. Therefore, also uh, we are investigating in parallel uh, machine learning techniques to be involved in order to uh, uh, support the channel characterization, but also uh, the network management. Furthermore, uh, in order to, to prove our concept, we are also going to uh, design uh, antennas and meta surfaces as a such in order to be able uh, to prove and demonstrate the system. Well, for the time being, uh, we are still uh, at the completing the research work, which means uh, different channels models are now uh, compared and investigated. So, uh, towards uh, next six months, uh, we will be able to perform a performance analysis of the entire system and also to implement our demonstrators. Uh, so, we are working currently on three demonstrators. One is the point-to-point -point, uh, communication in the D-band. Uh, the second demonstrator is uh, uh, to show uh, application of the meta surfaces within an indoor scenario. And the third use case or demonstrator of the project uh, will be dedicated to machine learning techniques uh, to show how we can characterize the, the channel, uh, how can we support the channel modeling, uh, channel characterization on one side and also on another side uh, to manage the network, access to the network and uh, these kind of things. Well, now this is of course significant work in uh, putting together all the components of the demonstrators. Of course, based on the theoretical results we achieved. Uh, so currently we are testing different individual components of the system. Uh, front end of the radio system, uh, antennas, uh, putting this together in order to be able to, to present the results within the uh, demonstration activities uh, at the project end.